Knives. After the match we saw previous. <laughs> 13 unforced errors for Kostyuk so far. that time everything down the middle of the court until Chimwen and Coco Goff respectively. Goff next on court after this one. Oh, oh wow <laughs> you do not get more perfect than that from one side to the other. Even the second serve was 150. And Naomi Osaka getting better every match on the tour. Job not done, but she's given a shock to the number 19 seed. Osaka was simply back to her best. Perfect. From the first point, I mean, it's hard to manage to hit so precise from the first point till the end of the set. The question is, can she do it to the end of the match? When does a level that's drop? That's it. That's uh, that's the main question here. Having said that, since going four love down, she's won. Four games to two. And the cycle will probably reduce that to four three, so it's just the best. Oh, well, three second serves and still Kostyuk hasn't had a look in, in this game. How about that for a game, Naomi Osaka? Yeah, but it's, it's incredible what she's doing with her today, Naomi. for a second break, bided her time, but an absolutely killer forehand. Nothing Kostya could do about that, wasn't playing a bad point. Serving quicker than she was before the break, over 175 with most first serves. No depth. Just couldn't get a foothold in the rally. Asaka was on top, punished it, and takes the break again. Almost unplayable. And there it is. The first serve gave her the advantage in the point. She didn't relinquish it. It's a masterclass from Naomi Asaka. Turn back that clock. 6-3, 6-2 against the newest top 20 player in the WTA rankings. Sets up a third round match against Derek Asakina. We'll have a look at the draw in a moment. But what a fabulous performance in just a little over one hour and 10 minutes. Both sets taking 36 minutes. The Kostyuk disappointment, she'll probably slip out of the top 20. But was beaten almost as much by the name as by her opponent, but didn't Osaka play well today?